Hello everyone, it's Sarkov12, and today, uh, Divide was gracious enough to give me the unuploaded file to his Red Hood song. So I didn't think I was going to be able to get to any reactions this week because it's just a busy week for me. But thank you, Divide. You've made things a lot easier for me. Um, I know a decent amount about Red Hood, but also, well, oh, that's not what I wanted to click on. <laughs> This is already going off the rails. Um, yeah, I don't know what direction he's going with. I haven't heard anything about this song uh, on on uh, Twitter. Uh, I know a decent amount about Jason Todd, mostly because of the Panda Red over on TikTok. Uh, so I look forward to hearing this because Jason could be taken in a lot of different ways. You could take Jason Todd and make a song about him in multiple ways. Most people focus on the angsty, revenge-filled, almost Punisher-like aspect of uh, Red Hood. Knowing Divide, he could easily take it that direction. He could also focus on the more sympathetic and tragic parts uh, about it. He could do both. Um, so let's hear... I don't know what this song is called, but you can find the link in the description below, because by the time this reaction goes out, uh, the song will have already been up for like an hour or so. So go support Divide. Go run this up. I don't know who's on it. I don't know any features. I don't know. Uh, I don't know anything except that Nikta is the one that created the video. So shout out to him as well. Without further ado, let's get started. It's already kind of eerie. Turn that up. I guess it's called a death in the family. Definitely tragic so far. Not gonna lie, when it said fall and you will see, I was expecting like a guitar riff to pop up. I was expecting the like the somber tone to switch to anger. Um But I'm kinda glad it didn't. Because A, it 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 subverted my expectations, but most importantly, it this definitely feels like it's focusing on the tragedy of Jason Todd and the creation of Red Hood and why Red Hood does the things he does. So I mean, switching to the anger-filled thing would not be out of character for Jason Todd. But I am actually happy that this is not an, at least so far, I, this is not an anger-filled song. It could easily change at any point. But as of right now, it feels like this is a more somber song. It's for, focusing on the tragedy of Jason and his rise to Red Hood, which is a different take than I think every other creator has done. And I like it. was what I was expecting. That is where, where like, that was the, the anger, but it was still somber. Like, 
it was very clearly more aggressive than the rest of the song has been so far, but it was still very somber. It was still very bittersweet, very heart wrenching. I like it. I like it a lot. That was brilliant. You should feel me And yeah, you should run I'm tired of dreaming Of what should be done I'll never be your true dream To escape from your reality I like the cadence of this hook, too. Like, I love... I love the cadence of the hook. I can't quite put into words exactly why I like it. I just know that like I it it's rhythm is just so it's so pleasing to me and I really am, am enjoying that. Mmm. Mmm. That was good. That was fantastic. I'm so, so very, very happy that Divide let me listen to that a little early. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed it too, because in terms of like emotional depth, that might be one of the most emotional songs. Like, okay, when I first started listening to the song, Part of me thought he was going to go the same direction as the second Todoroki song, which starts off, you know, kind of, uh, I'm not going to say lighthearted, but light sounding because he uses a softer voice and then he just kicks it up a notch and gets super aggressive and angry. And I figured it was going to be similar to that. This actually, it was like a combination of his first Todoroki song with like, what other song has he done so far? Because the like the the really somber slow parts where it was like basically just the piano before the chorus gets in, um, it reminds me of his first Todoroki song in terms of like how remorseful and somber it, it you know it sounds, and then when the hook kicks in, it reminds me more of I guess what we're used to with Divide, um, because he doesn't do stuff like this like the somber aspect uh, or somber songs in general very often um i can't remember what song the hook reminds me of but it reminds me of something but the point is it it it, it meshes so well and like i said i love the cadence i love the rhythm of the hook that was just, it was just, just like sonically pleasing to me um yeah but what do you guys think do you guys enjoy it i enjoyed it um if so let me know in the comments below uh, and in the meantime, thank you for joining me. This is Archive of 12, and I shall see you in the next video.